Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today's video is episode 2 of Basic Science. If you haven't watched the previous video, watch the previous video. Okay guys, let's start. What are levers? Levers are rigid rods that are free to turn about a fixed point. Are levers simple machines? Yes, levers are simple machines because they make our work easier. Is crowbar a lever? Why? Crowbar is a lever. It is because it turns about the small stone kept below it and the big stone gets lifted. Next guys, we are going to study about fulcrum, res effort and resistance. What is fulcrum? The point about which a lever turn is called fulcrum. What is effort? The force we apply to lift the stone is the effort. What, what is resistance? The resistive force that is overcome by the effort is called resistance. In the position of fulcrum in all levers is not between effort and resistance. On the basis of the positions of fulcrum, effort and resistance are levers can be classified into three categories. Next, we are going to say about some examples of Examples for fulcrum, effort and resistance. Stapler Haven't you seen a stapler? Fulcrum is at one end. There is where the provision is made for the stapler blades to move. We apply the force at the middle part. Paper is kept at the end or posted to the fulcrum. This is the resistance. Effort is in between the fulcrum and the resistance. Forceps A stapler and a forceps work on the same principle. Here also the effort is between the fulcrum and the resistance. Cutting piler. Here the fulcrum is at the middle. Effort and resistance are two ends. Scissors. Scissors has the main working principle of a cutting piler. The fulcrum is at middle and effort and resistance are two ends. Lemon squeezer. A lemon squeezer also works on the same principle of a nutcracker. The resistance is between the fulcrum and effort. Next, spoon as a lever. Why is a spoon considered as a lever? Spoon help us to work, do a work in an easier manner. It is difficult to remove, remove the lid easily by the hand from a tin. If it is tightly fixed, fit, fitted to the tin, but if we use a spoon, the lid can be lifted very easily by gripping the spoon more or less at top.